Let me show you how to get your abs A1. I'm gonna show you. I got you. Thank you for your comment. That's all you need. I didn't even have abs before. I found this ruler like a week ago and started working with it. This is how I do it. Like that, and you gotta make sure you're stretching. Don't even pull back, just stay in that zone. Stay in that mode and just eat. Stay in that mode. You can pull it back a little bit sometimes. Stay in that mode, stay in that zone. Stay in that pressure zone. And eat, and eat, get that core stronger. Woo. I put it to the side like that, hey, don't bleed. That's ah. side. Ah. Ah. Gotta fall off you, building that strength. Ah. I hear that, you working though. Y'all see, you don't look like that. Love you, Marcus W. Ooh, feeling good, my body feeling good. It's about the range, but this is the day to work on things I'm lacking. I'm lacking with the forearms. So I like to get forearm work in, like that. Wrist curls. And I just did some ab work too. Abs is looking good. Feeling good. I may still work out in the rain, one of the days in that mode. Then I come over, other side, wrist curls. This is how you get them forearms bigger. This is how you get them forearms bigger. Them barbell wrist curls, and you gonna feel it. Then start pumping. See, that blood rushing. It's that forearm. You gonna feel it, ah. I also get you one of these. Get you one of these, buddy, from five below. One of these buddies. This is how you get that wrist work in. Like that. You can turn this up on any, like, the highest, get a hundred, hundred squeezes. You can even hold, hold a quarter in there. Just hold it like that. Just hold it. Give yourself a hundred squeezes. On each hand, flip the hand. Another hundred squeezes. That's gonna get that grip right too when you're working, when you're moving, when you're shaking. And also, we feeling good in the rain. I'm going to keep it going. Keep it coming. Feeling good. You know, also, with these, with the weights, the 10 pound, 10 pound, you go like that. Bring it up. Bring it down like that. Like that. This is how you grow. Like that. And also, if you want to grow, your forearms and your body and your bicep. Get yourself a little weight like that. Get my hammers, hammer curls. Get hammer curls on each side. That's gonna work the forearms. That's gonna work the wrist. Get yourself a fat grip. Get yourself a fat grip. You see that? Get that wrist work. Hold that shit tight. Hold it tight and get that work in. Do your thing. Look, y'all see, we working. Make sure you hold it tight. Y'all see, other side. I like to do both sides. <laughs> it raining, feeling good. Look at that, hold it tight. This is only 25 pounds. Y'all see the, y'all see it. You gotta put that work in. It's not about how long you do it, but how efficient you do it. Ooh. Then forearms right. Then forearms right. Then forearms right. Then biceps right. Keep that back right to here. Y'all keep living good. When it comes to how many calories your boy eat in a day, it's your boy, it's your boy eat in a day. It depends, bro. Probably like 3,000. But I work up, I work hard a lot. Work out a lot. Be up on my feet all day. I work like 60 hour work week, bro. And when I'm when I'm not doing that, I'm getting the work in. So I'll be trying to eat what I want. And then I train hard to burn it off. I may go into a bulk or I may go into a bulk one day. You never know. I'm just doing going with the flow, doing what life takes me. And right now, it takes me places that I never would imagine. Never would imagine. Never would imagine being this big, 
don't really count your calories too much. You know what you should be eating. You know what you shouldn't be eating. If you want to lose weight, eat less calories. If you want to gain weight, eat more calories. My thing is, with this fitness thing, you'll be over -compl complicating it, doing a bunch of workouts, a bunch of th different things that don't really work at the end of the day. I'm gonna let y'all know what work at the end of the day. I'm not about to sugarcoat it with y'all. Not about to do nothing extra, no extra routines. Gonna help y'all out. The meat and the potatoes, bro. Cause you don't need all those extra those circuits, weird circuits. Those are just to get views, bro. That's just to push the views up, bro. Give you attention. Not really to grow the platform. Not really to help. Not really to be a trainer. I wanna grow the platform by helping, you know? Cause at the end of the day, I work hard, bro. Work hard for my money. I don't gotta do no extra shit. Like, no like view scams, no ploys, no nothing to get money. Been doing this creative stuff for a long time. A long, long time since high school. So I can teach a lot. It was working out too. I learned. I had to learn this so I can teach it, bro. Whatever you're doing, learn it, bro. And then teach it. Because you never know. Someone else might fall in love with it and teach it too. And make the world a better place. It's all about making the world a better place. The world is beautiful, bro. The world is beautiful. Enjoy the world. Enjoy your time. Enjoy the people that you're around. Have fun, bro. Don't let nobody hold you back. You don't ever give up for nobody. Love you. Mark the W. It's raining, but the rain don't stop no work. The rain don't stop no shine. And I'm shining too. So if you're trying to change your life, trying to do something, feel like you're stuck in a rut, get this book. Get this book. Can't hurt me. David Goggins, the man. After I read this, started running, after I read this, started running six miles a day. Get it, get it, read it. You can look up his story on YouTube, but it's not like the book. Also, after you read that, hit up this one, living with a seal, and hit up this one, living with a monk. And if you're a real hustler trying to get some money, trying to get some bread, my boy 50 got the book for you. My boy 50 got the book for you. Let me get some work in while it's raining. While it's raining too, feel good, feel shiny, feel glistening. Bro, that David Goggins book really got me into reading, bro. I never really cared too much for reading, but as a black kid, a black boy, black man, read, bro. Read. It's very beautiful. You like lose yourself in the book almost, man. I love it so much. I'm gonna get these books inside before they get rained on too bad. But I like to feel the pump, man. The books can get dry, bro. Let me get the games right quick. Ooh, feel good, bro. My name is Marcus, Marcus W. I'll be the biggest Marcus W to ever live. You'll know my name. You'll know my name for sure. Life's been good. I'm enjoying it right now before everyone knows it. Cause I can just chill. I can just chill, having fun, enjoying life. You enjoy your life too, have fun, make somebody smile, do your thing, you are somebody, Mark W. We're going to use the rest of our Greek yogurt. And when y'all are getting Greek yogurt, get Greek yogurt that you actually like, because the majority of this shit is nasty. So get one that you actually like. I like this one. We're going to throw that in there. I don't know if I'm a montage or no montage. We're going to see Throw my Greek yogurt in there. That's it. Now I got a mixture of. Is, ooh, 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 they're falling out. It is blueberries, bananas, and some strawberries in there. Yeah, so blueberries, strawberries, bananas. You see some of them strawberries now. Uh, all in there. Let me show you the strawberries. Strawberries. All in there. I'm going to get the rest on the side because this is my shit. You would too if you're doing this at your house. So don't come in the comment section acting crazy. This is what we, this is what we looking like. And then I'm going to throw some water in there. Hold up. And then water. Thank you for holding up. Water. 
for the hydration. Now we're gonna blend that up. Let's get it on. That's what that buddy be looking like. If your container empty, you can pour it just straight into the container and store it. Pour it. Ooh. Store it. God, I will work very hard and put my all into my craft so no one around me has to struggle anymore. So no one around me has to cry, be sad, wonder where the next dollar is gonna come from or deal with management that treats them terrible and have to stay just because they need a check. I will work very hard and make sure everyone that loves me, everyone that I love is accommodated for. It's not about me, it's about them. I will give my all and give my last for my family and my friends. I want everyone to be, I want everyone to smile, everyone to enjoy their life, enjoy their time, and know that they can do whatever they want to do, and you're not living in anybody's world, you're living in your world, it's your dreams, you're mine, you're beautiful, and it's whatever you want to do, in Jesus' name we pray, amen, Marcus W.